Hello, my name is Baratun Dikola. I'm a faculty member in the George W. Woodruff School of Mechanical Engineering. My research areas are heat transfer and energy systems, and these areas are supported by my work in nanoscale materials for applications in heat transfer and energy systems. Everybody uses electronic devices, but not everybody knows that heat is a barrier to continued innovation in electronic devices. The research that I do, we develop new materials at the nanoscale that can dissipate heat from electronic devices better than any material known to man. My research basically addresses three areas that are of extreme importance to society. One, dissipating heat allows us to continue innovation in electronic devices. Two, solar energy is so important yet we still don't have low cost, widely available ways to convert it to electricity. And three, heat is abundant and it's a great opportunity for us to be able to harvest that heat and turn it to electricity. The thing all three of these areas have in common is that new materials are fundamentally required to enable breakthroughs in our ability to convert energy and transport it efficiently. I'm a southern boy at heart, grew up in Pensacola, Florida, just down the street from Georgia Tech. So being at Purdue University where I got my PhD, I was a little bit out of place. And I tell my wife all the time that when I came down to Georgia Tech on my interview, and I, I went to breakfast the first morning and, and the grits were nice and buttery like I remembered growing up, that I felt back at home again. I think Georgia Tech is a fantastic place. For me, it's close to family, the weather's great, the research is fantastic, and anything that you want to do as a faculty or a student at Georgia Tech is within reach. So I had a wonderful opportunity once to hang out with some Marines at the top of a mountain covered in snow. This was as a result of some money I had from DARPA. What I learned on that trip was that how it was very difficult for Marines to boil water from snow for drinking water. So I took that project and I introduced it to my undergraduate heat transfer class. And these students did a fantastic job with this. The goal was to design a better boiling pot, to take snow, turn it into water faster so that the Marines could get on with their business. The students designed, they analyzed this pot, and then they presented their results at a poster session near the end of the class. Some of the students even carried their projects forward for their senior design project. I've been fortunate in that the work that my group's done has allowed me to win two very exciting awards. One is the AAAS Early Career Award for Public Engagement with Science, and the other is the Presidential Early Career Award for Scientists and Engineers, other known as the P-Case. So both of those awards recognize not only the research that we do, but also my involvement in the community and outreach uh, for public engagement with science. Uh, as one example, we've taken an electron microscope and we've placed it in a high school for an entire school year for the students to develop their own curriculum around using that tool. My favorite thing about the Woodruff School is that the people are very collegial, uh, the students are fantastic, the large number of faculty that we have provides a diversity of research so that if you want to explore an idea in this direction or that direction, there's usually somebody there who not only does it, but is an expert in that. 